Uncle Hoosh's hat. Hey guys, welcome back to Harrison Hacks. Uh, today, just want to show you a preview of uh, the build I've been working on, and this is called Hyper Arcade. Uh, this is based off of HyperPi PC. I'm just going to turn this down a touch. Uh, and basically, I just want to give a shout out to all the creators and anyone affiliated with HyperPi PC. Uh, they've done phenomenal work, and I, I mean, my hat's off to them. Uh, basically, what I've done here is just take HyperPi PC, cut it down to arcade only content, and uh, modify a few things. Um, and the reason for this build is I like to have my console build, which I do use HyperPi PC as my main one, um, and I use that for all my consoles. And now I want one called Hyper Arcade, and this will be just arcade only, so that in the future, if I build myself an arcade cabinet or an arcade stick, um, or both, of course. Uh, then I can just have this as my one-shot deal. So, I'll give you a little preview here. Um, here is the main arcade wheel, and this is where all of your games will be. Uh, and each game has its own theme. So every single game has an individual theme. There are 1,949 game themes, uh, which is more than enough games uh, for me. Uh, but that's all the game themes that are available here is 1949. So basically in the main arcade wheel you're going to have every ROM that you've added. And I mean if you come to games with X-Men I've got, if you look on the bottom there, this is 4 players. It says 4 plus. And here's your 2 player version. And I've done that for every, every game that has a 2 or a 4 player version. If we step back and we go to... I've done a four player wheel so if we were to go into here this would just be all of the four player versions there wouldn't be any two player games in here obviously excuse me and we'll step back now we've got you know Capcom 1, 2, 3 um, a bunch of classics and collections you know the standard stuff that was in HyperPi PC uh, there's a bunch as you can see there so basically the difference between uh, hyper arcade and hyper pi pc is every game has an individual theme which i really really like um, instead of just having the standard background for a system with snap videos playing these these are snap video themes so every game has its own theme i really like the look um, and I just wanted to give you guys a little preview. I've been working on this. Um, so far it's roughly 18 gigs in size. Um, it's a lot of artwork uh, included, so that's it. Uh, there will be no ROMs or BIOSes included or anything like that. Um, what else can I tell you? Uh, it's running off of MAME. Now, I love MAME. This is not RetroArch MAME. This is, you know, the actual MAME program. Um, and... I went with MAME 0 0.185 uh, for this build. I know it's not the latest release, but to me it's the best release that I've used so far. Um, it just works It works great for me. I have no problem finding my BIOS files or my ROMs for it. Uh, everything is just easy peasy with, with 185. That's why I stuck with MAME 185. Um, and, and this is something that I'm going to continue to work on at this point um, for just to make sure all the kinks are out so far it seems perfect but I've got to I've got to make sure uh, I don't want to release anything half-assed so this is just a quick little preview um, hopefully you guys enjoy it um, once once it does come out there will be a, a full how-to video um, and so on so basically guys just Please like the video, uh, subscribe to the channel, uh, please consider um, supporting me on Patreon, that would be awesome. Anyone that already is, um, thank you very much for the support. Uh, again, I just want to say my hats off to anyone involved with HyperPi PC, because without them, uh, I, wouldn't even, I wouldn't even have created this build. 
uh, because I never would have thought how nice a build can actually look. Hyperpi PC is an amazing, amazing accomplishment for anyone involved, and uh, g good on them. I mean, my my hats off, uh, as I say too often in my videos, but it's true, man. It's it's it takes a lot of work for for what everyone does, uh, and I just want to show my appreciation. So, uh, everyone, please, you know, hopefully you like this video and have a good day.